Hello, I hope you're doing swell and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hi, my name is Alexis. I would love it if you stuck around. So today we are back with the Let's Make Over the Town Needs and we are finally doing the pancakes. Now I am a little nervous about doing their house because their house is as big as Spencer Kim Lewis, but baby steps, we can do it as many times as we need to with the house. We can take as long as we want to. I have to keep reminding myself. But for today, we're actually going in and giving them a proper makeup. Over, but let's read the pancakes description as well poor poor Bob and Eliza have they ever been happy it seems there's nothing one can do to please the other just what is keeping this couple together what is the spark that will finally drive them apart it seems like they're meant to be apart but we're gonna give them a makeover just to kind of doll them up some. I just feel like they're a little outdated. If you follow um, any of like The Sims videos or people who play The Sims, usually they have Bob and Eliza split up, which I'll probably end up doing or making their house when we make over it, like in two separate wings or something like that. But here is Bob Pancakes. He is a master chef. He has the essence of flavor. He's a slob, a loner, and he's also gloomy. And here's Evil Eliza, which all of us kind of hate. Um, she's a mansion baron. She's business savvy, neat, materialistic, and a perfectionist. So we're going to start off with Bob first and give him a proper little makeover. So this is his everyday outfit, his formal, his athletic, his sleep party, swimwear, hot weather, and his cold outfit. So if this is the first time you've seen like the Let's Make Over series, I'll have actually a playlist down below so you can see the format. But basically we do the every day together and then I go in off camera and then I update them all. And then we do like a final like fashion show reveal. So let's go into Bob's every day. Oh, I think since he is a young adult, we should give him a little bit more of an updated makeover. I do wanna keep the goatee, like the beard, but I, oh. I say that and I was like, oh, he needs a little bit of facial hair. Something like that. He has such a little baby face. But I want to give him some type of, something like this maybe. And then I do want to go in and update his eyebrows to my favorite ones, which is this one. And he always looks so sad. So just like Eric uh, Lewis, I'm just going to make his mouth a little bit turned up so he's just a little bit more happy. And then for his hair, I'm going to go in and actually update it. I'm going to go to the afro texture and find something that's a little bit shorter uh, to fit him. So we can do like some, some ball cap waves all around. We can do like a little party part. Or we can do some dreads. Honestly, some locks might look good on Bob. Something like this. Then also like this little fade on the sides. I'm trying to see what might look best. Oh, this is hard. I kind of want to do this. And then I usually don't mess with their faces too much, but I am just going to bring his chin like back a little bit and bring his jaw in. So yeah, there goes Bob. I feel like we should add some little freckles on him as well or some beauty marks. So let's go to the skin details. Maybe we can add some light little freckles on his face, like on his nose. But the men are so easy to do in this game. So I'm trying to think what might look best for Bob. Does he have any like generated colors that are his fave? Let me maybe do some likes and dislikes. So he dislikes the color pink. He likes Baroque music. He enjoys rock climbing. And let's also do enjoys mixology and cooking. So we're going to take off that pink. And I think since he is more of like a loner and gloomy, I'm trying to think of what pack might be the best. Maybe like seasons, cats and dogs and get to work. We can filter by that. Oh, Bob Pancakes. I just feel for the dude. He just seems so sad. Let's take off all his jewelry. And then I think there were some base game jeans that we got recently. They're like some skinny jeans. Something like this. A little updated. Oh, I didn't mean to do that, Bob. I'm sorry. Even those pants might work. I like the default color. And then maybe we can change the sweater to something like that. And then we can put some little socks on them. Just some white socks and some boots. Like these from Seasons. But like after dressing him, I feel like he should have somewhat of a bigger beard so maybe we'll put the beard back on him and then we'll give him 
I want to give him a little piercing, but I don't see one that kind of fits Bob. So this is Bob's every day outfit and I'm gonna go in and actually I'll put a ring on him. So that is Bob's every day and I'm gonna go in and update his formal sports sleep party hot wait swim hot and cold weather outfit and we'll do the final reveal of Bob pancakes. Alrighty, so this is Bob Pancakes. This is everyday outfit. I kind of kept a lot of the neutral tones just because he is a little bit of a loner. I don't think that he would like very vibrant prints to bring attention to him because I imagine he has like really severe anxiety and just kind of sad in the situation that he's in right now. Um, so I didn't want to bring too much attention to his clothes. So a lot of them do have those neutral colors, but I think he looks really good. So this is his everyday Bob's formal. So this is a touch of like a little bit of some sum just because I really like the outfit that he had on um, anyway. So I did put a little, little pattern, but you won't see much of that in a lot of his outfits and watch all of them are going to be like that that is his sportswear um because he does like rock climbing apparently now here's his sleepwear his party his swimwear his hot weather so we do have a vibrant shirt but i feel like it's still kind of calm and then also his cold weather outfit so that is Bob Pancakes, and we'll come up with more of like a storyline for him and Eliza. But for right now, I like the way the Bob Bob is looking, and maybe he'll turn his life around for the better and get out of his situation. But here is Eliza Pancakes looking a hot mess. This is her everyday outfit. I am gonna give her like a, a major update. So this is her everyday, her formal, her athletic, um, her swim. Wait, 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 wait. Formal, athletic, sleep, party, swimwear, her hot weather, as well as her cold weather outfit. So let's go into Eliza, and we are definitely snatching her weave and taking her hair off, because I don't like that. Maybe we'll do some thinner eyebrows, and we'll give her some updated glasses as well. Maybe something like this in a white color, or maybe a green color, since she she likes green and then for some earrings i imagine she just wears like little hoops for every outfit so i'll go in and change that as well and then for her hair so she doesn't need afro texture hair but she will have like like medium length hair straight and it's gonna be red so we can do something like that i never use that hairstyle and that short hair is really cute as well let me see what might look best even that bob and we can do this this bowl top haircut um i don't think i'm gonna do her dirty like that so she's a perfectionist and neat so i imagine her hair is very like zoom, like very particular which makes me think this bob would be the best because i think these are a little bit too messy so let's do this bob from snowy escape let's go in and put a little bit of lip gloss and makeup on her so I'm just gonna go all the way down and do a cat eye. You can't really see it anyway because she does have her glasses on. And we can do some eyeliner, do a little, little bronzy cheek action, and then maybe just like a light little gloss. She's infamous for this green top, so I'm gonna go in and search for maybe like an updated green, green little outfit. Something that's a little bit more like businesswoman because she's trying to embody that. Would she be button lip like this though? Kind of like this, even though it's a little bit of a crop. Let's do this. And then I think I'm going to put those holiday jeans on her just because they're the perfect high-waisted. Do them in like a lighter color. And then for shoes, I imagine her to have like little heels on. Something like these espadrilles in like a dark green color. Or maybe like in a gray. Cause we can do black let's see we change the color of her jeans to maybe those darker ones and then we go with like maybe these gray shoes that could work and then she does have a ring on so we're gonna keep the ring maybe her and bob are trying to like work it out but i am gonna paint her nails and i imagine her to have like a little french tip since you can't see her earrings because she does have this hairstyle I am gonna go in and give her a necklace. And these are like some of my favorites, these little stacked ones. So we might just go in 
with something like this. There we go, there goes Liza. So I'm gonna go in and update all of these different outfits and I'll show you the final reveal of Eliza once we get her sorted out. Alrighty, so this is Eliza Pancake. So this is her everyday outfit. I tried to make sure the colors that she kind of spawned with, she kind of kept that same color scheme. And also it kind of matched some of her aspirations and like traits, but still made her look like she was a young adult. So this is her everyday outfit. We got some paranormal pack, the holiday pack, as well as cottage living. And then I love the haircut and the glasses. So we pretty much kept that for every outfit but as well this is her formal I never used this dress it's from the vintage glamour pack I believe we just have some little silver heels on French tips and a dark lip for her athletic I decided to do a lot of um, university for her sleepwear we have some eco lifestyle as well as the little bunny slippers and her hair in a little bun for her party wear we have some cottage living and I think these shoes are from discover Maybe it's from the Paranormal Pack. No, it's from Parenthood. I just thought those looked really cute. And then I also painted her toes um, pink. And then she still has her French tips. And she has this like tangerine lip color on that kind of matches some of the flowers in her dress. For her swimwear, now I'm not too proud about the swimwear. It's just okay. So we're going to kind of gloss over that. But this is what she's looking like. Also, did not put her um fingernail polish on so let me do that and then for her hot weather outfit we have this cottage living blouse on um eco lifestyle denim skirt and then i think this is eco lifestyle little espadrille wooden sandal things but she also has a nice little pink lip on and then last but not least her winter outfit this is cottage living the holiday pants i think these are nifty yet yeah, knitting and then cottage living hat but that is eliza pancakes updated as well as bob pancakes updated we'll go in and do their house and everything like that um and then play with them a little bit as well just to make them a little bit more updated for the save file but i hope you enjoyed if you did make sure those fun things like give it a big old like and subscribe down below if you haven't already as well as press that bell notification so you can be notified each and every time that I post. I will have a playlist link down below as well as a card up above of the let's make over the townies and some other challenges that we're doing here over on this channel but until next time I hope you're doing swell and I'll see you very soon. Bye!